Hello, and welcome to the first Roblox devlog. Um, basically, this series is going to be about a game that I'm making, which I'm not really expecting to get like many visits and stuff like that. Uh, it's mainly for my, it's like a passion project of mine that I'm really enjoying on making, which I'm also making with a couple of my friends. Um, and yeah. Here, here it is. Here's what we've built so far. This game is called Shibes Towers. It is based off a very popular Roblox obby game called Duke's Tower of Hell, or Duke's Towers of Hell, or Jato. Um, I quite like those games. I, I feel like the it, it's the adrenaline rush. Really, it's the adrenaline rush of getting up to the tenth floor and then beating that tower because you spent so much time like getting to that floor and then when you finally complete it, it's like yes I did it I've conquered my previous best you know I've conquered this tower it's like a great feeling and I I wanted to make my own towers to both challenge myself in creating something that's original and unique although this is not really like original unique yet, just yet but and also to like express to show my creative ideas in towers and things like that so, as I said, this is a passion project by me and my friends, so we're not really planning on getting this out anytime soon. I'm just wanting to make this video to make it known that I am doing something, and also so I can actually upload something to my YouTube channel, which has like five videos right now. Not even five, probably like three or two, if I, three if I count the channel trailer, I think. Um, yeah, I, this is what we've made so far. So this is the lobby. It's very uh, reminiscent of like an old, it, it, it's like the forgotten, to me, it, it feels like the forgotten ridge um, lobby in Duke's Tower of Hell. I, I quite like this design. Uh, eventually, if we need to, we probably will update it, but right now, it's perfect for what it is. We're not planning on adding in anything insane. So... Yeah, we've just got we've got a chillax though, we gotta we gotta practice oh, but you already know how it is. We've got Choi's Chunky Chez. Now this is just like an inside joke with one dude that I talk to. Uh here's Troy. He's pretty cool. Um and we've got the two towers that we're adding so far. Two towers that we've planned. That there is more coming, don't worry. So the first one is Tower of Newcomers Ascent. I don't know if that's like the correct grammar for newcomers, but we don't worry about that now. This is going to be the tutorial tower. It's going to be piss easy, honestly. It's going to be the most easiest tower you can imagine. I Hopefully it is. If you guys fail, I'm going to be disappointed in you. And then this next one is Tower of Endless Suffering, or TOES. Don't ask me why I allowed this acronym, but my one of my teammates is making this entire tower by himself because he wants to get good at game design. And so I said, sure, make yourself a tower. You can make it hard or as easy as you want. Just go ahead, make yourself a tower. And we're, he's gonna do it after I after we finish this first tower, so we actually have something. Um, but yeah. And here's the team so far. It's me, uh, one f one friend and another friend. Base JRD one seven four eight is the one building toes. Uh, Tip of Paris is on holiday right now. I don't know what he's doing. But yeah, so apart apart from this, you may apart from the small itsy bitsy lobby, you may have noticed these three giant pillars of death in like you know on the corner. So this one, this one's just the template. I'm we kind of have to have it. I don't want to make another. I don't want to make like ten, a hundred by hundred floors, and move around the music rooms and stuff like that. That was painful when I did it. Um, this middle one here is Tona, or Tower of Newcomer of Newcomers Ascent, of course. The, e the easy tutorial tower. Keep it simple, keep it sweet. Um, we've so far done one, two, three, four towers. I had to count them, because, uh, yeah, whatever. I had to count them, of course I had to. Um, so yeah, and we've got another six floors to go. So this will be the first tower that releases, but we probably won't publish it until um, JRD finishes Toes, which will probably be like, depending on how fast we get through everything, because like I, since this is a passion project, 
we I I haven't really like this has been in the back of my mind. I haven't really done anything until now. This is like I started this like probably a couple month like a month ago. Um so I expect this to happen like I don't know when this is going to start being built, but we're planning on we're hoping to get this out by the end of December, hopefully on de but on December and then we start doing this one in January or something, hopefully. But yeah, this is what we've done so far. Uh, I just wanted to make this video to show you guys what we've, like what we've done, um, and yeah, we also do have some upcoming things. Like as you can see, we have a citadel portal, so we have tower, citadel. We have the Jato kit here because I am not too smart on coding, and this is in the toolbox. We can use it on a, uh, if we, as long as we credit um, Jukeries, which. Thank you so much for making this, or should, I should say Gamator, but same thing. It. <laughs> thank you so much. This has saved me so much time. But I hate the buttons. The buttons are a pain to figure out how to do. But you know it's fine. We will worry about that later. Um. So yeah, we are planning on adding three normal towers, one citadel, and a unique. Uh, a unique obstacle tower course called a palace. I came up with this like a week ago. I feel so smart, but it, it, it it's called a palace and it has a really cool design. We haven't made anything yet because uh, it's t it'll probably be like the last thing we release unless this game gets like super popular, which I highly doubt will happen. If I'm going to be honest, I'm not really expecting this to change anything. Um. But yeah, uh, there's a, there's gonna be a new thing called a palace. I, if you, as the, the amount of times I've mentioned it already, just by saying the word palace, tell, should, prove, should prove to me that I'm excited about making that that thing when I get around to doing it. But yeah, that that's what we're. This is what we've done. Uh, we also have the win room up here. Uh, now I don't know if I'll get away with this, but I've got a bunch of Nintendo music in this game. Which, I which represents like the mood of the towers and stuff like that. We've just got some other things in here. I pray that I don't get copy striked on this video. So anyway, let's go play. <laughs> let's let's go play this because I like I was gonna do this video and I originally wasn't gonna say anything about like the music right of it. So yeah, welcome to the game. We have some Earthbound music. Blah 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 blah. I will say it is quite loud. Give me a moment. I'm just going to mute it for now. But it, it does change. So if I walk into the chillax zone, it changes. Wow, look at that. So cool. But it, that came in the Jato kit, so I'm quite... It it, do, it takes a while to work, but, you know, it's all good. Yeah, so you know, it's, it's a pretty it's a pretty nice obby. A uh, pretty nice lobby. Not even obby. Um, you know, we've got a, we've got a basic practice obby, as I said. I don't think I've actually said that, but, you know, it's got some... I'm just... Okay, look. I'm I'm tired, right? It's like 11 o'clock. I'm making this video because out of the spur of the moment, but, you know. You know, basic obby. Blah, 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 blah. Wow, look at that. You finished. And then you reset your character. Um, yeah, so there's that. Uh, the, the teleporters work. I'm not going to do Tona because we haven't done that, but... There we go. Ta-da! So the, t the teleporters work. The wind pads work. I don't know if this wind pad works, actually. We'll just go figure it out. Um, but yeah, most most of the stuff has been like found on the toolbox, because, you know... Yeah, okay, look, it does work. Ta-da! Wow, look at that. All the code works. Yay. Um, that took me too long. I mean, even though I was just copying all the code I found. Um... But yeah, it. I mean, it's it. It's just a passion project. I'm very, like, I I don't know how to express this. Like, I was, I'm just excited because I've wanted to do make a game, of like something that I'm proud of, not like one of those stupid cash grab games. Um, and this is this is something that I'm that I'm passionate about, and I'm like, I I really look forward to like building um more towers, m creating unique ones, especially that palace, man. This palace is going to be so cool! But, <laughs> like, honestly, 
Um, I'm just, I'm just excited for the future for this. And yes, I will do more videos updating like things like for example when we complete a tower, um, when you know, uh, like some other events. I'm I want to do events, but I feel like that's a bit too much. We'll see. We'll see about that. Like maybe like a once in a blue moon Christmas event, or like a once in a blue moon Halloween event. But um, right now it's just the most bare bones game you can imagine, which is fine. I, yeah, I'm just excited, and I'm just making this video to both start off this series or like this Louis playlist that I have in the in the back of my YouTube channel. And also, so, if you guys are interested, you guys can, like, look, f see these updates, look forward to it, and then you guys get to play what I've made, which I, I, I think feels, I, I, I think that's pretty special. I mean, I don't really have, I'm not very important, I don't really feel very important, but, um, yeah, I'm just excited for the future of this, and, uh, I hope that when this game eventually comes out, which will probably be like, uh, I'm going to say halfway through next year. Not a promise, but ideally, we would release it halfway through next year, so like, yeah, uh, maybe August, I don't know. But mainly mainly because it's a passion project, we still have lives, we're not, we're kind of doing this off on like the side and whatnot. And not mention the fact I'm also going to be doing videos as well, so... Yeah. I got too much... To do. <laughs> but yeah, um... This is what we've done so far. I hope you enjoyed this really badly filmed video. Uh, I did not plan this. This is not scripted. I've not planned this out at all. I just kind of did it on the work because I felt like it. And I was like, screw it. We'll do it. Um... Yeah, I just... I hope you guys will enjoy... Enjoy this game when it eventually comes out. I hope you guys will enjoy these updates that I'm going to be giving you every now and then. When something get, when something like major has been done, I will make a video on it. Hopefully, if I don't feel like burnt out and bored. Um, yeah. Anyway, thank you for listening to me rant on about me being passionate about this, and uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. I don't know when that's going to be released. I'm going to be honest. So, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys some point in the future. I'm signing off.